Hello, tiny planet explorers. The internet has given us great, great power. And as we all know, great power comes with a butt ton of responsibility. So are we using that power sensibly? No, of course we're not. Something really dark and putrid that we're using the internet for is to feed this craving, this obsession with wanting to know everything about celebrities at all times. To the point where it's like, dude, these people are human beings. Think we should like, Give them a bit of privacy. If you think that unsolicited videos or pictures or surprise tours of a celebrity's house is just part of the job, then you're wrong. Weirdly, when you have any kind of following, you're lumped into this category of celebrity. I personally do not class myself as a celebrity in any way, but by definition, I'm a dude with a sizable audience, therefore, celebrity? When in reality, I'm just a dude with an active imagination and an endless supply of cardboard. Well, this morning I woke up to a link to a celebrity website that included a bunch of information about myself. The reason I say information is because although it's written as if it's legitimate, hard facts, it's actually just an incomprehensible mess of drivel and garbage, scrounged from various parts of the internet and mashed together by what I can only imagine is a child or a monkey. I thought it could be fun to read through one of these heaping piles of misinformation together just to see how accurate it is. Wiki net worth, celebrity article, biography, and net worth. PJ Liguori, wiki, bio, age, height, girlfriend, dating, family, net worth, personal life, private life, money, money, age, location. How, when was the last time they went to the bathroom? They've not even used a photo of me. They've used a screenshot from a video from 2011. That's probably not gonna be the worst offense, so. A British photographer. Is, is that why I am now? Is, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a photographer. He's na he is the, his name is the, what? He is the man, wait, what? He is the man name is PJ Liguori. He is the man name. I am the man name. The guy, the guy, cool. Just, I'm just the guy, you know. I'm just, I'm just the guy. Everybody just knows me as the guy, you know. The guy was born in Peterborough, England on 11th December 1990. The boy is born, oh, I'm the boy now, am I? I'm the boy? I was the guy a minute ago. A minute, a minute ago, I was PJ. Now I'm the boy? The boy is born to his parents and raised with his siblings and his friends. <laughs> no shit was I born by my parents. <laughs> See, I thought I hatched out of an intergalactic egg. This makes more sense. The guy is YouTube entertainment artist and musician whose profile, Kick the PJ, presented humor videos and animations. Yep. Definitely written by a child or a monkey. Thinking more, thinking more monkey at this point. The man started off making videos and films in 2007 and won a Virginia Media Award for PJ, Tiny Planet Explorer in 2012. Virginia, it's actually Virgin Media, but it's definitely not the worst butchering of it before. An article once wrote that I won the Virgin Award. <laughs> I, I don't know what that award consists of. The 26 years old guy, not 26. I'm not 26. I'm not 26 years old. They know I was born in December 1990 because they wrote it. <sighs> Monkey no good at maths. The 26 years old guy has a high net worth with gets massive salary through his series and profession. Here we go. <laughs> According to some net worth and wiki sites, he has an approximately net worth of over $500,000 with good salary. So I apparently have half a million dollars net worth and a good salary. Not a great salary, but it's it's okay, you know, it's decent. I don't think this has been fact checked. And especially Instagram advertisements also paid him some of the nice money. Some of the nice money. None of that evil money that we're hearing about. It was some of the nice money. You put it in your pocket, it says, hey PJ, you're looking good today. I'm like, hey, that's some nice money. Thank you very much, appreciate it. Yeah, Monkey definitely wrote this. <sighs> This is difficult. But he kept his investments field secret. Either he invests or not. <laughs> what? <laughs> he creates confusion for us. I'm so so I, you know what? I am incredibly sorry for creating any confusion about my personal and private bank affairs, investments or not. And after this video goes live, I am gonna make all of my bank details readily available for anybody and everybody to access. I think that is the least I can do. I don't wanna create any more confusion for you. <laughs> This is insane. But it seems that he is happy with his net worth and enjoying with his salary and satisfies with his assets and properties. <laughs> my many, my many properties. I hope the guy also earns huge net worth in the future. That's, <laughs> have they put an opinion in there? This is meant to be coming across as fact. Why is the writer 
put their opinion in there. Hope the guy earns huge net worth in the future. <laughs> you know what? Thank you very much to the random author of this Wikipedia knockoff website. It's, it means a lot. Coming from coming from you, it means a lot. You know what? I'm starting to think that not even a monkey wrote this. Some kind of lifeless, inhuman goop must have put this together because this is too good. The guy is still unmarried. The guy is still unmarried and also kept his personal bio under wrap. <sighs> but our deep research, deep research, that, wow. They apparently have access to deep research, deep, deep research, but still got my age wrong. Our deep research, we've found some extra and interesting facts about the guy. They are extra and interesting. He is unmarried, but it doesn't mean is not interest with any girls. I mean, fair point. Fair point. I'll give him that. Not he is in love. Yes, the 26 year age YouTuber star falling in love with his cute and beautiful girlfriend, Sophie Newton. The pair has been romantically dating since couple of years ago. And no broke up rumors gossip yet. Hope they will marry soon and live happily with their family and friends. Thanks again for throwing in the opinion, really balances out the facts, you know. I have never read a biography before where the author has put their opinions in there. It's an interesting angle, it really is. <coughs> the fuck was that? I'm melting, I'm totally melting, let's wrap this up. A young and handsome British celebrity, PJ, has a height of over 6 feet 2 inches, with over 58 kilograms of weight. <laughs> Could your estimations be any more vague? That's just like saying, and he weighs, he weighs. Deep research. You know, I am personally glad that they have used their deep research to source this information. Otherwise, this would have been filled to the brim with nonsense. The guy has a slim body with well built up body figure with six pack body shaped size. Wow. Wow. Can we just read that again? The guy has a slim body with well built up body figure and six pack body shaped size. <laughs> the guy has an attractive face with handsome looks and also a fit and healthy body. Finally. Finally, they have got something correct. Jesus Christ. I was starting to lose faith in this biography. You found him also on his social media account. <laughs> what? Is that, is that really how it ends? You found him also on his social media account? <sighs> so there we go, that exists. Definitely not the worst that I've read about myself, and believe me, that was bullshit. I read this biography once that claimed that I have rage blackouts and beat my dad to death with a baseball bat. The very same dad, may I add, that rhymes, that is still alive. Very, very much still alive. See, I want to say that the moral of this story is don't believe everything you read on the internet, but I think the true moral is stop writing garbage about people that you don't know. How about that? Thank you very much for watching. I very much hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you did, and I'll see you crazy space kids in the next video. I'm gonna go write some false information about PewDiePie.